Lawmakers will be back in Frankfurt tomorrow as the legislative session is coming to a close with many bills filed, others vetoed. ABC 36's Anna Medina caught up with a lawmaker on his thoughts from the session from the highs to the lows. I think this year we, we've done a good job of, of communicating. As the legislative session winds down, many emotions ramping up. This year, bills that seem questionable, others that seem like a step in the right direction. For Senator David Yates. I guess a lot of the highs and lows can go through the budget process. Senator Yates reflecting on how the process went this year. I think that a lot of the infrastructure investments we were able to get through, I think we'll do well. Um, I think we have an unprecedented amount of money coming back to my district, to Louisville area, which is exciting. Um, but, you know, some of the things that I thought were going to be gimmies at the beginning that, um, you know, we talk about the teacher raises because how important it was to make sure we attract teachers. But we also looked at the return on that investment from education. Yates adding that one of the bills he was most passionate about did not get the discussion it should have. To someone who's already been victimized, had been abused and, and hurt, um, and now is carrying a child of sometimes their father, their rapist, depending on what it is, and sometimes it's just these children. Um, for now, the state to come in and say there is no choice. Um, I, I think that that's wrong, and I think a lot of Kentuckians agree. And um, ultimately, I don't think that decision should rest with me or any other member of the legislature. I think it should rest with the woman. The senator also adding that while certain legislation seems to be moving slowly, especially with regards to gun violence. And so I know there's a lot of people frustrated that how slow it is because people are dying. Um, but we've got to just keep moving forward. I mean, if you if if you can't fly, you run. If you can't run, you walk. If you can't walk, you crawl. But we keep moving forward. Yates even sharing his thoughts on UK search for their next basketball coach. Uh, to me, it's a priority. Uh, and it's it not just as a fan, but um, economically. We, we, when our programs are doing good, when we're top 10 in, in, in you know, in UofL and UK or kicking butt, um, we're making money at the universities. We're able to provide better levels of education, um, but also doing some talent attraction. So, um, Hats off to them. I know the search is hard. Um, I think that I know that there'll be um, there'll be a lot of love put behind it. And and what I mean, to coach University of Kentucky, what an honor. He also says that if there are any issues that are currently affecting the community, to contact your senators and representatives rather than waiting to do so during the legislative session. For ABC 36 News Now, I'm Anna Medina.